hunt them down. You have the micromanager every second, apparently. Okay, you chase them down. You guys come this way. Can you all go this way? Now, was this an ambush for us or was this an ambush for them? This is like with, with the debuff in the melee defense as well. We do want to chase as many of them down as possible here. Take their city over there after. Surrounded, but let's help them out anyway. You charge them, and you're gonna charge these. Phalanxes fall apart pretty freaking easily if you surround them. Look at that. And they're gone. We just want to slaughter as many of them as you can. Capture them or whatever. It's kind of hard to tell like where there's enemies or where there's not because our troops are like using all different kinds of shields as their like their own. That should be it. The great escape. I don't think it's an escape. I think it's a slaughter of the enemies. Ambush my ass. Well enough, I was hoping them to attack us. Even though it, I mean, even if it wasn't an ambush, it would go pretty much the same. I might have lost uh, a couple of less troops, but that's about it. Okay, apparently he survived. Somehow. even need to wait for the other army now we can besiege him immediately i guess a good way to like get the big battle in hmm, wait a minute this is our problem no never mind those are the other ones we hunger for that. That's your command. 
actually give him time to replenish. For one more turn to replenish. At your command. Should we attack immediately? Hmm. Ready for That'd be better to attack immediately. See what they want to do. Right, two more prick up base. No, no, don't know why that switches over like that. We want more Triaria, but we don't have enough manpower for that. Yeah, that's what I mean. They have a shitload of garrison units. March. We hunger for At your command. You go there as well. We have a small fleet. I wish I had actual like a yes. bowmen on my ships so we can actually do damage from the shore. And that would be pretty good. Your orders. Keep a wet eye open, men. It's not gonna help in any way. Let's see. They might be tempted into attacking one of those two. Hopefully. Okay, this for that, for fine. Research is complete. You want to get the Empire maintenance as low as freaking possible. As soon as possible as well. Here Want to, to trade? Nope. We can eat a couple of turns of... Um... Your command. Actually, we could just recruit more uh, archers since I'm going to give it to the other army as well. Yeah, go like that. Okay, so next turn we're going to attack him and kill him. Unless their friends over there in Massalia come to help them. Oh, they're not friend friends anymore. Sparta like have territory here and up gold here. Is often taken to be a yeah, look at that. Of deep affection and respect. Ooh, that might change a few things. Should have sent a spy. Well, we don't have any more spies. Should have sent an agent of some kind up there. Oh, right. What's our garrison here like? I'm pretty sure I can beat that with this unless they decide to besiege it forever. But I think they're gonna break the siege as soon as we siege them. We take this settlement for I might actually out resolve this. We could fight it since they all. Where the fuck did their navy go? Probably over there. If I have to assume. Put your backs into it, you men! Victory. Uh, sure, I'll fight that. Why not? Minus 10. This is finally stabilizing. 
much should be actually better check here right they yeah, still no the reforms are gone so we're fine on that end okay let's do this even though it's gonna be like cakewalk Celtic warriors and Celtic tribesmen Celtic bowmen good thing I can like keep the damage the, uh, damage troops out of the battle next turn we can help the city out over there and even if they take it which I don't think they are we can easily take it right back yeah, yeah I'm gonna go take a piss while this loads so we'll be right back You fog. Who likes fog? Well, let's do it with fog anyway. Make it a little bit more dramatic. Plus, I, um, I can't remember if you can use fire arrows in fog or not. Right, we want to keep these guys out. I guess them as well. I'm going to retreat them. I guess the best possible way here is to just attack them from all fronts. Jupiter gives us. I think the enemy AI fleet is actually gonna try and land somewhere over here to like stop us a little bit. Well, that's not gonna go well for them, obviously. Get a couple of guys here, then we're gonna plan to rest over there. Hopefully I can retreat these. Should be able to. Come on. Yeah, withdraw. Withdraw. Our reinforcements have arrived. Oh yay! Bunch of ships. The hundred forty guys in them. Look at that, they're gonna try and land there. Eh, fine with that. Except they're, I think they're archers. No, they're raiders. Eh, just let them come anyway. Okay, group these up. Or the AI is gonna try and rush us. Might be a tank. Is it they're gonna literally just charge my fucking... Apparently is... Fine with me. Let me just set up the rest of them. You guys are gonna stay there. Apparently. You spread out.
Okay, at least they made the AI just uh, do something smart for a change. So they're not gonna sit there and wait till I go get them. Why did my archer spawn in? Like, that's the one unit I was hoping for. Well, let's get you on your way. They're trying to get up the hill. Kinda seems like it. They're gonna tr charge them, that's for sure. Okay, no, 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 no. That's to be expected. I should just come. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Yeah, where are the fucking archers like having the other army? Or do I have the max here? Yeah? Hey, I don't think we need you. Just retreat. I'm fine with their general just charging at us constantly. That's gonna work for out for us. Yeah, look at that. One of our units has used all its ammunition. All right, let me get this cav. To do something useful. Okay, they had like, like a chance to charge straight at my. Skirmishers and are they gonna take it? Are they gonna take it? Finally, or not? Works for me. You guys go get those archers. Get him out of there, though. Run, boys, run. You charge them. Actually, since these are wide in the open, attack them as well. It's fine. The battle is turning in our favor. Already, it's turning in our favor. Melee infantry. There goes their archers. I'm gonna use them to charge these guys in the back. I guess you guys get into the flying wedge as well. Just so we can free up them. Free them up. We're gonna get off the fucking boats or not. Decide already. Brave Romans to a man. Equities! And command us! Ready and waiting. Ready kings! One of our units has used all its ammunition. Okay, come this way. You just charge them while they're if they're that close. No 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 no! Don't get don't get caught! Come on now! You know better than that. One here is falling somewhat. These guys are gonna get sandwiched. Your 
we'll recharge those. Actually, you just charge in the flank of those. Why the hell not? They're not that much better. Well, they're already breaking. So much for them. Actually, you spread out like this so we can sandwich all of them. Yeah, of course, there's a fucking enemy there fleeing to stop my command. And their boats don't know what the fuck to do. I guess, uh, just get in there. You wanna... You wanna chase the cab? Sure. There you go. Let's make things easier for you. don't know what the fuck to do. We might not get any more reinforcements because these guys are actually here. So that might be a thing. Because they are technically infantry units. They would have made this a lot harder if they just stayed there. And I spread out like a moron again. Maybe I should like place my infantry in like normal formation all together. And if they don't come out, then divide them. Oh, Wait a minute, are those archers? Yep. Command. Nick that easy freaking peasy. Commander. They can hold on for a little bit longer. Ready for orders. No, they go for here, I can't remember. I can go for all three of these. Do you know that? Exploding charge bonus, construction media siege equipment. Yeah, those. I mean, the, the, the like the garrison troops in these like city. Oh, look at that! They notice them. Like the garrisons are like sh shit units, so that's why that was easy. Yeah, I'm gonna wait a minute. How long is it gonna take? 10 turns. I'd rather just demolish it and get the. get the faster upgrade. build the shit, to be honest. Ready for orders. Okay, they're not allies anymore, right? Actually, they are. Oh, that's bad. Actually, Commander. move him like there. March. That might stop them. From like getting over there to join them in this in the attack, because that's the only thing that I could actually like damage us at this point. Everything else is fine. Actually, this guy level up.
like the garrison units. I mean, they're uh, they're decent. Telling swordsmen, telling town guard, local citizens, local archers. Well, let's go take a look at the Roman one, I guess. Telling swordsmen, telling town guard, and telling slingers. I mean, they're decent at holding, but if you flank them, they're almost dead. They're and they're, they're shit in attacking. So I don't know why the AI chose to attack there. To be honest. There's no way that would go that well, more like Your good oldest. at all for them. We do want to place them outside so the public the order is shit in there. Okay, man, more range, morale, attrition. Mm. Let's go for more range, I guess. No, 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 ally territory, public order, increase income from looting settlements, we don't do that. I guess the morale is going to be the, the, good, the best thing there. Right, what do I going to... I want to go for a logistician. Want to go Dread Commander as well with him? Commander, right, I could have switched out these archers. I will see what happens. Yeah, the Latin culture is pretty good there. What about here? 61%. Yeah, we can uh, turn that off here. For now, I'll like get more tax rate here because we are hemorrhaging money at this point. It's four, one. Mostly from squalor. I didn't do this. Uh, which ones were good again? Campaign movement right, map range. This this sucks. Chance of successfully launching an ambush. I guess that this negates that somewhat. Additional loss of besieging. Uh, Hmm. I guess let's do that. Ugh, three elephants. That's your command. We hunger for battle ready for battle. Hmm. It'd be a good That's idea to command. move this guy to Rome for a little while. Imagine if we can set up an ambush with a fleet. Oh, that would be perfect. <laughs> so we can ambush them like while they're moving from uh, one city to another there. See, I'm wondering what they're gonna do. Those, uh... I have talked to the wise woman Wait, there's a faction of Musalia, but it's not. The... And our what? elders see greatness in you. Didn't notice that before. I... Let's see what they do. Because the other army is gonna starve the one that's besieging. Either way. Even more so now when they do have a settlement. Yeah, they fucked off as per usual. But I do have to like keep in mind that they're there. Because they're probably going to try and uh, attack that. Maybe I could set up an ambush or something. Oh, 
Ooh. So what, we can only select three? Ballista or Scorpio? Okay, let's see if I can manage this. I mean, I could auto-resolve this. Well, let's do it manually. I see a whole lot of shit in their armies, to be honest. And again, they are the barbarians, they should be shit. Like how I tear. Ooh. Look at the aqueduct that's uh, broken and leading nowhere. That's f that's funny. Oh yeah, look look at that. And it's broken on this side too. Looks like they're coming at us a single way. No, I'm not sure if you're supposed to, or like, is it a good idea to actually... Where can we place these? I guess we can defend here. Uh, because I'm not sure if it's a good idea to defend walls. Romans ready for duty. Wait, this... Yeah, literally standing in the one place where we can't actually p place our ballistas or defenses to get them, funnily enough. Maybe from here, maybe we can get them. Is there anywhere else? Doesn't look like it. Well, that sucks. Oh my god, look at how many slingers we have. So that, I'm not actually sure if it's a good idea to defend the walls or just uh, let them take them. And like hold down to these walls. I guess let's make a tier defense. So we do get towers here as well. Or at least one, well two of them. Uh, or we should uh, should make a tier defense. That should work out for us. Yeah, that Ready and sucks. Waiting. Getting these into a good position is gonna be annoying. Yeah. Okay, like that. Even though slingers are gonna do exactly shit at them. You know, spear of tree, medium, medium melee, very light melee. Like we have heavy infantry now, defenses and light, light uh, on guard. So their army is like shittier than ours, considering we have heavy heavy melee infantry. Okay, have a couple of those. They do have a battering ram, so I'm gonna stick these there. And I guess what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stick these at the like uh, where they le can uh, get off the get off the walls, and then move the slingers down as well. I'm gonna hold these or actually here because what the A is gonna do is probably gonna funnel through here and we're gonna just uh, flank them. I mean, barricades, find crabs.
I don't find placing these anywhere to be... Ooh, I guess we can place them here. Make sure, like, our guys can get out. I don't think we can uh, get those. Shop stones, impedience, progress, preventing easy mi missile troops. Right, we can place these outside. Or not. What the fuck's the point of these if you can't place them outside? idea to play. Let's place these like here. I literally can't tell where they are. Who the fuck are you supposed to see that? Anyway, let's start this. Oh, that's a little bit disappointing. Look at the size of that thing. Jesus Christ. Only this one might be able to squeeze a shot in. Can it? Yeah, it can. Nice. Wait, I can toggle guard mode? I should have placed the slingers up on the walls here. Even though I don't think they're going to be able to shoot over through the aqueducts or anything, but uh, let's do it anyway. You get any kills? I don't think they can they? Nope. Holy Wait a minute. Oh my god they can. Might have fucked up the deployment then. Got zero kills though. You target the enemy leader. You target. Oh that's gonna work out for them if they bunch up like that. Yeah, these guys aren't gonna get any, like, kills. It's gonna be worthwhile. Maybe I should've went for the defensive things on the sieges. In the, in the technology tree, right? <laughs> Boiling oil and whatnot. I think their archers are gonna deal more damage to us than we are to them. Slingers. Unless they get into range. Maybe make sure we can get these guys off in time. Sons of Mars, indeed. What's up, Hunter? How's it going? Hopefully they don't take any damage while going down there. It's been long, so long since I've actually fought a siege. You gonna move? Come on. Everything fine here. I think we're gonna be able to hold this with no issues. What's the pro we did get ambushed. Quote unquote. Then we wrecked the entire enemy army. Easily. Because their armies are full of shit. 
trash. Yeah, I don't think they're gonna be able to make that shot, so fire at these. Got these. You fire at the Equites. How the hell are they taking that, man? Do the lag. Like, surely we have more troops there. Come on. Or I guess you have to be on the walls, right? Well, this is Rome, too, man. I don't play. I don't want to play vanilla, though. Bit too boring to be honest. Do these guys actually have a shot at any of this? I mean, it looks like the enemy is just gonna ignore the like other ways to get in. So let's place these guys there. Oh my god, why is the lag? Why is the game lagging when I try to set up troops? That that makes no sense. Look at that. Look at these. Back here. Oh my god, come on, game. Place him. Well, the shotgun ain't boring that much, vanilla. I did play a lot of hours of it, though. So that's why I like want to try and play it with mods. I don't know why the Last Alliance mod doesn't have multiplayer. I mean... Uh, if you have the same version, well, that's like the biggest problem with uh, mods for Total War. You have to have the exact same versions of the mod in the exact same fucking order. Or else it's gonna tell you that you have a different version. That's kind of always a pain in the ass to get right. Could have just sat on the... I do wonder if I set like my sing slingers like low right... Where they they can get at them? Wait, they... Look at that! The game's lagging to shit. Forty one, forty six percent of the CPU is being used. Thirty one of the GPU. I think it, it's just the game engine at this point. Yeah, look at that. If I check my graphics, I have a 3070 and a RX, uh, a 3700X. And they're not being used at all, if you can look up on the left, top left of the screen. I think it's just the calculations going on. But if I look this way. I think it's still the same. Yeah, the game engine can handle it, apparently. Alright, let me get these into a better position at least, then. Spears! Hey, look, look at the lag, Jesus Christ. Order! I think Order! it has something to do with placing this stuff. Etium! The barbarians are hijacking my PC. Could be. <laughs> I think it's just the it's the enemy. Look at look at how much shit there is here. Okay, now they're taking the towers. Ah oh, shit! Well, it's too late now to move these back. I think. Or it might be too late to move them back. Yeah, it's probably the amount of the troops because uh, like each one of ours has 200. And each one of there, I think uh, theirs have 200 or maybe even 300 for some of them. And they're all like jumbled up there. Okay, 
Okay, you come this way. What the f... I told you to attack here. Yeah, look at that. The bad finding might be fucking up here. That's why it's lagging. Stop going that way. Come on. Come on. Yeah, the P CPU and GPU aren't being used at all. It's probably the amount of troops. Okay, now it's a little bit better. Uh, maybe you should have placed a couple of troops there so we have control over the towers for a little bit longer. Okay, look at that, now it's fine. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Where the f Why the fuck are you going there? there? These guys use up all the ammunition. You try and hit him. Heavy melee infantry or uh, very light melee infantry? Who's gonna win? It's freaking fine. Now they're going for the other tower. One of our units has used all its ammunition. These are still like pretty high morale, and I do want them to get over here. Because I'm gonna uh, flank them and wreck them there, sandwich them there. So let's get these guys here. Ready and waiting. Well, apparently they're uh, all over the place here. The like ants. The field of this is a shameful display. Who fled? Where fled? No one fled, apparently. Oh, one of the... One of the ballistas fled, apparently. Yeah, it's probably the the fact that the, the 3700X or the 3000 Ryzen series still didn't have uh, that much of an IPC advantage over Intel. Or they weren't even close to Intel in terms of IPC. So that's why. And if it's only using like two or three cores or even four, uh, it's not gonna help me out that much. Look at that. Yeah, we're just gonna. Yeah, uh, look at that. They have 300 troops in that uh, in that uh, unit. That's why it's lagging. Fighting Bowman, apparently. Or whatever that fucking is. Mercenaries. If you do want to, like, maybe control the towers. Else that might suck for us. Let's get, actually place them there. What are these guys like? Who knows? This is a shameful display. I would have gotten an Intel processor had I known. Well... Had I had the 3700X at that point. No, not the 3700, uh, the 3017. But I got the processor so I can actually stream with it. Now I don't need it, but I guess I could sell it. I can look into that, actually. I switch out my system for, for an Intel one. 10, 10, probably 10th 10 gen Intel. Yeah, we might want to hold down to the towers. That's going to help us so much. You do a lot of damage. I 
I could have held them here, I guess. But I do want to see them come this way. So we can flank their asses with these guys. Look at that. I think the game lags because, like, same as in Battlelord, when you want to place troops where they can't fit, it, like, fucks up the engine or something. One of our units has used all its ammunition. What the fuck are you doing? Just stay there normally. Now the game's paused. Literally paused. Missile infantry. Okay, these guys got the Well, they're getting a decent amount of kills. Not bad. The only problem with those is they're actually gonna They're, they're going to stop routing at some point. We got two towers now. Although these militia break brought the town guard. Where what? Italian town guard. Yeah, they broke. So they're going to push through now. They'd kill a shitload of them, and there's big tracks. Did they place them here? Can't actually remember. Yeah, there's somewhere here. There's spike traps somewhere. These guys are still formation breached. You don't have a formation, you fucking morons. But you stay there. Their cav units just bypass ours. General, our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful. I should have placed this somewhere closer so it actually has a shot on them. What's this? A lion with a ball. You got a lot of the attention to detail, though. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Look at that, an amphitheater. Pretty small one. I mean, considering how big they were, actually. Oh, that's nice. Uh, they retreat and they retreat into a gate that fires arrows onto them. They might just literally... Why is that being taken? Come on, you stay there. I guess the problem is that these two towers are actually firing on our guys. So that's like uh, fucking, up, fucking us up a little. Hmm. We might actually see them flank. Us too. So let's let's get these guys into position. Apparently, these guys do have range on them as well. Then again, like I said, if we do lose this, we do have an army just sitting, like, literally right by this. Well, not right by this, but in the next province. Are you firing? Wanna see you do it?
Oh shit, I forgot about that. Oh fuck. Oh, fuck, I forgot about the multiple victory pointing. I mean, we hold this. An entire unit has perished. Give upon shrine. I hope this game is not gonna fuck me up because we can auto resolve this as well. Hopefully, I can hold just this point and we're not gonna lose the battle. These guys are still holding. We have lost a victory point. Oh my god, come on game. Oh, that fucking changes things. So fucking stupid. I, I hold this and this. What the? F I guess that's the main one, right? Even though this one should be. Oh my god, yeah, Jesus Christ, that sucks so much. Uh, guys are actually gonna fail yeah the game wants you to be stupid like the AI is apparently look at that I'm literally gonna lose because they took that oh, fucking hell I don't think I can get these guys in there in time to save it If that's the thing, I'm just gonna auto resolve this. Fuck this shit. Or I could just fight it again and then hold them at the walls, I guess. Jesus Christ, that's so bullshit. So what's the point of having three of them then? The enemy is about to capture the fort. Play. Look at that. Look, 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 look. Oh, fuck you, game. Fuck you. We're gonna hold the walls then. That's so. Oh my god. I do wonder if they if, if I let them took another like another one of those victory points would would the thing be the same? We need to hold all three of them. Did I actually make a quick save? I'm not sure exactly. Might have. as hell now we have to sit through and watch that um, let them like wash up on us again die horribly <laughs> 